In this article, we're going to jump right into showing you how to reduce various noises in HVAC systems using various sound attenuating techniques. Individuals vary in their tolerance for noise, as some like a little white noise to help them sleep while others require complete silence. Although we're not studying sound related to sleeping, but sound found in public spaces like offices, hospitals, schools, and conference rooms. Let's start with the sounds from a neighboring office space. If you reside in a large office building where the return air system is unducted, then each office has a return air grill that allows the air from the space to return to the air handler through the ceiling plenum, which is shared by all the other offices. If you're hearing the individual in the adjacent office, then the sound can be traveling in multiple paths to your ears. One could be that the walls are uninsulated and sound is reverberating through the walls. The other could be that unducted return air grill. First, we'll show you the standard HVAC contractor solution to noise at the return air grill from a return air plenum. Number one is the return air boot, which is an elbow usually fabricated using fiberglass ductboard. This will require some method of attachment to the structure, as it can't just sit on the grill and will take longer to install than other methods. The next is to install a length of flexible duct attached to the return air grill while the other end is left open to the return air plenum. This method will also require some method of attachment to the structure to prevent the flexible duct from collapsing on itself. The next method is to use a manufactured fiberglass or foam return air canopy, which is lightweight and sits on top of the return air grill without any additional support. The canopy also reduces visibility into the ceiling plenum. They come in standard sizes of 2x2 two two or 2x1 two foot. They usually are less expensive than installing an acoustical elbow and install in less time. When there are full-height walls blocking the return air path, contractors often just provide an opening in the wall above the ceiling to allow the return air to get back to the air handler. This also allows noise to travel freely from one side of the wall to the other. The option is to use a lined section of ductwork with two elbows. This will help dampen any crosstalk that might occur. There are manufacturers that fabricate these, or the contractor can have them made in their own sheet metal shop using fiberglass board or other sound-absorbing materials. Duct silencers. One of the more common methods of sound attenuation is the use of duct silencers, which can be installed for a relatively low cost. These come in round or rectangular sizes and can be built to large sizes by adding more modules. The noise emanating from the rooftop package unit to the floor or floors directly below through the ductwork can be mitigated. A duct silencer can be added to the main supply duct closest to the rooftop air conditioner. Another can be added to the return air main duct. This helps mitigate the sound emanating from the package unit through the ductwork to the upper floors. If you have a rooftop unit that has a horizontal duct discharge, then you can add a duct silencer to a section of duct on the roof. In modern energy retrofit projects where there are vane axial fans or utility fans installed with sound attenuators, the practice is to remove the fans and the sound traps and install a fan wall system which is a lot quieter and doesn't require the additional static pressure that is needed when using sound traps. See our other video on how fan walls work. If there is a mechanical room on the floor next to occupied spaces and noise is emanating out from there, then there are several solutions. First, there is another version of a duct silencer that can be installed as a 90-degree elbow. Noise can radiate from equipment through air conditioning ducts or directly through the wall to the occupants. It's important to identify the source of the noise and the path by which it reaches the occupants. In this case, it's the air handler in the mechanical room adjacent to the office space. There are several methods that can be used in this situation to reduce the noise transmitted into the occupied space. The solution varies in cost and effectiveness. There are products available to dampen sound that is traveling through mechanical room walls, such as the use of acoustical wall panels. These panels come in various wall thicknesses from 2 inch to 4 inch, with a layer of fiberglass sandwiched in between a solid metal outer wall and a perforated metal inner wall to help with sound absorption. If there is an occupied area or a sensitive building or space close to the air handler room, and the noise is emanating through the fresh air louver, then a special acoustical louver can be used to dampen any noise emanating outward. This helps dampen any noise emanating from the mechanical room to the exterior spaces nearby. Compressor blankets. If the source of the noise is from a refrigerant compressor, there are solutions to dampen the noise. 
Noise can radiate out from compressors located anywhere in a building or from rooftop equipment, like an air-cooled chiller or packaged unit. Even though the equipment is designed to be as quiet as possible, there is still some residual noise that may be bothersome to the occupants. These acoustic blankets are custom-made to fit the particulars of the equipment and can withstand the outdoor elements and the working temperatures of the system in addition to providing accessibility for maintenance. These are just some of the solutions contractors use to dampen HVAC equipment noise. Let us know in the comments below your experience with HVAC noise and how you solved it so that our viewers can add more tools to their solutions kit. If you found this video helpful, be sure to check out our HVAC and plumbing estimating spreadsheets to streamline your construction bidding process. Check out our HVAC, electrical and plumbing construction forms to help you run your business and explore our online courses for in-depth training.